Hello, my beautiful Libras. How are you, loves? I hope everyone is doing well. Libra, I welcome you to one of our special readings. And this reading is regards someone from your past. Could be an ex, could be someone you at one point have a very strong connection. And for some of you, there is still someone who you're still longing for or still probably want to connect. We'll look more likely into where they are. Do they still interested in your life or into your presence? Will they come back or what's going on out there? Will you want to go back or should you just move on? Whatever is this person, definitely it's for the Libras who are looking for this specific reading. If you are not interested in anything related to anyone from your past, just move along as these readings are not for everyone. And since it's a requested reading, we will follow through. Let's see loves what we got for you and how these energies are there for yourself. Libra, it's your major arcana, justice here. Eight of Cups, Six of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. For some of you, definitely you are separated here. Could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, could be another Libra as you are. But definitely I feel here some kind of legal situation happened. Something here definitely could be said or been said. However, also with the Six of Pentacles, certain things here were not balanced or somebody definitely needed balance or feel the need of balance. Whatever that balance is, emotional or even financially for some of you, so let's see, the Four of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Six of Swords. I feel also for some of you, I, I, I see a one-sided connection. Even though you, you try to move on, you're still thinking of them or they're still thinking of you. There's something here about moving on from a connection. For some of you, it could be from you they needed to move on or from someone. Because I see here you, you could try to move on from this person or walk away. However, you, you could share a very beautiful connection at one point. Okay. For some of you, you definitely will see this person very in a very short time let's see what's this six of pentacles magician queen of pentacles definitely i see very strong earth energy ten of cups strength of swords ace of cups this person does love you loves does love you for some of you you shut down the communication and move on but this person does love you they still do they still want to be around you but i feel here they needed to do something out there the ten of wands speaking of will of fortune you definitely will see this person again Three of Pentacles. There's something here that took a long time. We have Queen of Wands, Sun, Knight of Wands, Knight of Pentacles. So they they could need to end a connection so they can come forward. What are you thinking? The Nine of Swords here, the devil, the world, will they, if they've been involved here with a fire sign loves, they more likely will end that. Okay, King of Cups, Three of Wands. 
Somebody here could manipulate this connection. King of Swords, Queen of Cups, yes, absolutely. So I see you between, it's kind of definitely somebody here being, being connected with someone else. Death, Fool, King of Wands, Seven of Cups. They will come with some kind of apology, loves. They absolutely will. Moon, Hierophant, Seven of Wands, Hermit, Judgment, Nine of Cups, Queen of Swords, Three of Swords. I also feel here for many, many of you, there will be a conversation. I see the month of June for some of you. They might tell you that they went back to work because of the connection or to work on the things they needed to. But something here tells that they are trying to drag the time to keep you around you, to keep them around you. They are telling you certain things or you think they will give you certain things. But at the end, this person act quite immaturely. So it's your decision, loves, if you will bring them back or not. Because it seems here, for some of you, it might go in circle with this person over and over. Should you stay? Should you move on? What's the energy? The Emperor, Chariot, Eight of Swords, Two of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, and King of Pentacles on the Star. I feel here there is a big strong attraction between you two, but it's kind of like you definitely will move forward or you will end up to let go this person or just keep them in a, in a friend zone than in a love zone. Because for the Libra I'm speaking here, definitely this person still involved here with someone. Even they tell you I separate, they could separate, they could not legally separate for some of you. I feel here this person definitely is still out there and not really moving on. Could be a Taurus for some of you, that's what I'm hearing. The advice for you, we have choosing your path. You are the one to choose. They got to choose whatever is there. But you have something much more out there, loves. There's much more out there for you. With the gates of triumph, success expands in your life. For some of you, if you are a happy person or you are a professional, I feel here there are certain things here will improve in your life quite a lot. And this person might feel like it's a person to not lose or it's a person worth to keep. Pay attention, loves. That's a big red flag because the one who will definitely love you, they will love you unconditionally, not for what you are or what you bring to the table. Because definitely I see here for some of you, that's quite a thing. At one point, indeed here, you will clear the air and feel like, you know, grateful for whatever ends and definitely there is a big big change out there for some of you there's a some sort of conversation between you and this person that will definitely will uh, will clear a lot of things between you two or a lot of things that were um, kind of messy for some of you this person is not gonna change so you got to change another thing here for some of you you might feel here i rushed into this connection not knowing necessary it's always an experience keep in mind that we learn as we move through our life and sometimes definitely we want certain things but they might not be good for us. 
So that's to understand certain experiences coming up in our life to move us towards our real path. I definitely see here there's a Libra who will very much focus on their career or on their expansion being by themselves. I also see here a uh, Libra that definitely you are will expand career wise. I see here great finances as well. Absolutely. I do see very much success coming in. And for some of you, it's just kind of coming naturally or coming easily. But then you will think, yes, a lot of people want and wants to be around you. And certain people definitely, definitely are worth to pay attention and give them a chance. Because I feel here you are very much an independent Libra. Mind your own business, doing your own thing. But hey, sometimes, yeah. Don't hold back and whatever it is, because I definitely see here other things will come to you. And indeed, certain things are worth to keep an eye on. Follow your intuition. Whoever comes into your life, follow your intuition. I feel here there is some kind of mistrust for some of you or people who you're meeting in your life you don't really trust. There's certain things also for some of you, loves that's coming in from could be your family or the environment you you used to not necessarily from this person for some of you yes from this specific person comes this that you definitely want to be here with someone but they definitely show you that this is not what you can grow with so pay attention to those things that being said, loves, thank you for coming forward. Thank you for in tuning with these energies. If you feel this is your reading, let us know. Other than that, blessings, and I'll see you next time. Namaste.